Hey, Tim Unkert here. In this video, I'm going to use Python to create a program where you can figure out the slope between two points. But first, if you like videos like this, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications. This really helps the channel grow. And if you've already done that, thanks. All right, so let's pull up a draw island here and talk about slope just a little bit. All right. So All right. So, slope. Okay, that's rise over run. All right. Rise over run. Okay? So really what that means is your second y coordinate minus your first y coordinate. And it doesn't really matter which point you pick as the first or the second. You just have to be consistent over your second x coordinate minus your first x coordinate. And the way we would read this is y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. That is your slope. OK, and all right, so we're going to do that. We're going to create a Python program to do that. OK, so I'm going to pull up a text editor. I'm using Emacs um, for this video. I use Vim and Emacs. I, switch between the two, but Halloween is coming up, so I should use Emacs in evil mode. Okay, uh, I'm going to go to my uh, Dear Ed directory editor, and let's go down to Python programs, and let's create a new file. Let's call this, um, let's call this slope underscore yt dot py, okay? All right, and let's now create a class and let's call that class slope, okay? And let's instantiate that class, okay? And we're gonna take in the self and we have to take in a couple values, x1, x2, y1, and y2. Okay, and let's say that self dot x1 equals x1, self dot x2 equals x2, self dot y1 equals y1, so, whoops, self dot self dot y2 equals y2. Okay, so that's our, we're initializing, we're instantiating the class. Um, and let's now create a function to, or a method to figure out the slope. So let's say def, um, we'll call this find underscore slope, and we're going to pass in the self. And all right, so slope, our uh, slope is going to equal, get ready for it, self dot y2 minus self dot y1 divided by self dot x2 minus self dot x1. Okay. And we're going to return the slope. Okay. All right. So we're out of that method. We're out of the class. Let's create an object called uh, new slope going to equal slope uh, and we're going to pass in um, well four items and those are going to be um, x1 x2 y1 and y2 okay and then we're going to say uh, we're going to print uh, the well let's do an f string the slope is Okay, and we're going to do the new slope 
I used control N, evil mode, uh, new slope, and we're going to pass in, um, oh, no, sorry, we're going to do our method, which is find underscore slope, okay, and let's do a period after that and close that out, okay, so now, what we probably need to find is our x1, x2, uh, y1, and y2, okay? So I'm going to say x1 equals an integer form of the input, um, and then we're going to say, what is the x value of point 0.1, okay? And then... Oops, see that's Emacs telling me, hey, you didn't do something right. You need an extra parenthesis there. Okay, and then x2 is gonna equal the integer of the input. What is the x value of 0.2? Okay, and then y1 is gonna equal the integer of the input. What is the y value of 0.1, okay? And then y2 is gonna equal the integer input of what is the y value of 0.2, okay? Cool. All right, so we've got that stuff going. Um, I think that's good. And um, maybe we should run this program and see if it works. All right, so let's uh, open up another window here and let's switch over to that window and open up a terminal and let's run this. Okay, so I'm gonna say Python three um, and then the name of the function slope underscore yt dot uh, pi. Okay, so what is the x value of 0.1? So let's do something easy. Let's do from the origin 0 0.00, 0, so that 0 0.1 will be 0, 0, and then um, 0.2 will be 1, 4, right? So you go over 1, up 4, slope should be 4, right? So what is the x value of 0 0.1? Let's say 0, okay? What is the x value of 0 0.2? That's going to be 1. What is the y value of 0 0.1? Well, that's going to also be 0. What's the y value of 0.2? That's going to be 4, okay? And we'll say the slope is 4.0. Seems to be working very, very well. Let's run it again and try something different. This time, let's aim for a slope of 1 half or 0.5. So to do that, let's start at 0.11, and let's go up 1 and over 2 to point. Uh, three, two, okay? So what is the x value of 0 0.1 is one. What is the x value of 0 0.2? It's going to be three. What is the y value of 0.1? It's gonna be one. And what is the y value of 0.2? It's going to be two. Slope is 0 0.5. So our program is working exactly as we want it to. I hope you found this video uh, helpful and um, encouraging to write some cool Python. Uh, you'll notice the theme I'm using on Emacs right now is Space Max, the Space Max themes. It's not the Doom themes yet because it's not October yet, not the month of Halloween. But come October, I'm going to be uh, doing um, Doom themes, okay? So you may be thinking that was random and had nothing to do with anything, and you'd be correct. All right, anyways, uh, so if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications as it really helps the channel grow. And uh, if you've already done that, thank you, and I hope to see you in the next one. I'm being a little goofy today. I just got back from a long hike, really had great scenery, So, and then I wrote this nice little program. It's just so much fun to me. All right, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one, hopefully. Uh, now I gotta stop the video. Oh yeah, I just got in here.